Welcome, Leo, to my channel. I will be doing your reading. It is the the, the 30, sorry, the 21st of goodness, May. We are in Gemini season. I hope you're doing amazing, Leo. Uh, this is for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Thank you for subscribing, liking, for leaving comments, and uh, sharing the video, and all the good stuff. Thank you for your presence, and welcome to anyone that is uh, new <laughs> uh, to the channel as well. Let's start your reading, shall we? And uh, see what is in store for you, especially in love at this time. Um, yeah, the ju uh, judgment, it's uh, the four of ones and the judgment. Certainly someone is picking up on, um, well, they see a future. They see, um, this could be Sagittarius. They see, yeah, they see a future with you, basically. You might have been in a relationship or discussed a relationship with this person in the past. Um, definitely Ten of Cups as well. Someone is sad uh, about not speaking to you, um, Leo. Yeah, someone is very sad about speaking to you, not speaking to you. There could be... Um, Okay, so there is a tower moment that's gone down or it will go down when this person is reaching out to you. There's possi possibly like a bankruptcy or some loss of finances. Someone is also healing, taking out time. This could be a Pisces, Scorpio. Um, Leo, I'm picking up that you are you have tamed someone, tamed someone's ways. This was a very difficult connection or uh, relationship. It Nothing was going in this relationship's favor from day one. But what's been in this connection's favor is that it's a twin flame union. It's that you will always be pulled back to each other. It is that, you know, your intentions is to connect with this person. It is a strong spiritual connection for sure. But someone here is going through, it's like they have to change direction, they have to get out, uh, get out of the gutter in a way, and they have to stay on this healing journey. And things could, could uh, very well uh, end up, um, you know, there's an awakening. Someone could be going through a spiritual awakening. Someone have to shed an old skin. They have to kind of there's some a big burden they have to, to release um, because they feel stuck, they feel unmotivated, they feel tired, uh, they feel that their whole life is just turned upside down with the hangman. This person could be very sensitive, there could be a lot of small things that has piled up and now this person, they don't know how to get themselves out of where they end, they, it's like they Something's been shaken up around them. It's, if it's a separation with you and them, they feel, you know, they it's just really shook them. This person could keep their emotions to themselves. They could block people. They could stay, you know, on their own as well. They are crying. Uh, this person is some, yeah, they are feeling uh, worse for wear. But uh, this person, they they want to, they, they feel like they, they have a purpose now. They have a purpose uh, since they met you. Someone... They do require time to heal, to get their mojo back, to understand they have ability and they have all the resources and to manifest what they desire. But there is something about they need a break, they need to repose, they need restoration, they need to relax and take peace and self-protection. Alone time. I see this as someone that they feel they failed. Um, they feel they cannot move forward with anything in their life they are just someone is uh, feeling very very stuck they don't know what are their opportunities there is a few tower moments happening in this person's life okay yeah I, I see someone it's like one thing after the other have happened to this person and it might seem like it's coming out of the blue and with a hangman and the tower, it's like everything's crumbling, a sudden change, and they're waiting for things to improve, but they are kind of so frightened to do anything themselves because they just don't know what to do. Uh, it's as if something is happening like out of their control um, with this person here, okay? And this is someone that have been successful. They know how success 
feels like, smells like, uh, okay, and this person feels like uh, they're, they're stuck at the moment. Something has definitely happened to this person where it's suddenly gone from good luck to bad luck, I'm picking up. Could be Sagittarius, also uh, Pisces, Scorpio. I have Taurus, Cancer. So something unforeseen has happened. It really has wiped this person out as well. Uh, there's just something, there could be other people's fault, but it's affected this person. Uh, their feelings is that, you know, they are a peaceful person, they are a calm person, okay? But now they feel like everything is, like, this person is really going through it. Um, and I don't feel like it's self inflicted here i do feel like actually something's happened to this person uh leo that th th this could be someone taking their money uh if, if they were in a third party if this is a pisces there could be um an earth sign here or someone that was the breadwinner they sort of took took their bread uh, and left as well it just came out of the blue it could be a mother figure it could be um a, a third party it could be a boss it just it was taken away from them and uh, now they're starting a spiritual journey they're trying to find figure out what went wrong there is grief there's breakup so there's something about changes in their living situation changes in their work situation something has shook this person and things will again uh come into fall into place but they need some time to reflect, reflect, I can speak, reflect, self-evaluation, reckoning, purpose. They need to find the purpose. That's what they're looking for now. They need to find a new purpose. Um, yeah, something crumbled. It was, maybe it wasn't even on, they thought it was a strong foundation, but it wasn't. Because when this, this thing fell to pieces, they have then got this awareness and that they maybe have been leaning on too much on a crumbling tower and didn't want to see a tower crumbling. And, and now they just feel so sad. There's something about you that feel love cannot be rushed now. They've sacrificed this love. Uh, there's uncertainty, stepping backwards. So this tower could have affected their relationship for, for this to get off the ground and they feel like now they've lost you forever. This person is don't have any positive thoughts uh, at the moment. They feel um, tired. They feel, yeah, pretty much defeated uh, energy around this person. But uh, let's see, uh, Leo, I see that you give this person a lot of strength. Um, they're like, they very much enjoy communicating with you. Um, it was like a, a rocky start. And, and maybe it never did get started. Um, there's something about like you and this person being separated, even in the chaos uh, around this connection. Uh, you are still, you still want to to move towards this person. I don't think they know that. They they, they think that you don't like them, can't stand them. Uh, it's something about they do feel very sorry for themselves, even though they could have also done something. They could have also um you know come forward they could do something but they are just the way they view things is not from a, a rational perspective at the moment because of the everything's just it's still shaking around them okay you have a different attitude here where you're saying okay let's uh, keep things calm and uh, i'm going to you know i'm going to take my sword out of the out of my back i have done it before so this person could have caused the towers themselves the cell themselves sorry because they are unstable, they are acting on a whim. So because they're acting on a whim, maybe they didn't even realize they're acting on a whim, something to do with finances, it's just this, or out of breath looking at this person's cards, okay? This is someone that could have just been confused, deluded. Like the Seven of Cups, it does take the hit, it's a bit slower with the, Tower, it's, it's, it's kind of takes that, it could be love, like there's love in an organization, work, or in a place, okay? But the tower wipes it out, so it's not the time to discuss love. But the five of cups, someone here is like, no. Uh, <laughs> it's like, yeah, see here, Leo, you are, I know, again, you are um, mentally thinking completely different. This, this person and you are completely different the way you think. They are thinking everything in a catastrophe and disaster, despair. They, you know, they are, a, they are someone, 
of course, because someone can also impact that themselves, the way of thinking, okay? They need you and your rational thinking, okay? When they're around you, they feel, okay, things make sense again. I do see that there is a separation here that feels brutal. This could be two people that was getting to know each other and then boom, like this thing happened and it's like two people don't know each other well enough to kind of pick up the phone and because there's so many emotions going on with this person here, it's like this person is going through an absolute nightmare. But it has something to do with you even though if you are apart, I'm picking up. It's very crazy reading actually. I like kept watching an earthquake. It's like this person every day they have a, an awakening, a realization. Okay, they they might have to have a, they have a realization that they have been acting on a whim. They've been irresponsible. They've been immature, and they just don't want to. They just don't want to face that. You can't be dealing with a Sagittarius, uh, Cancer. I feel like some uh, Scorpio. Uh, someone have definitely water is Pisces in their chart. Um. You, you are have a different mindset here. You are sort of saying, okay, you could be in, like have a strong business mind. You've seen chaos before. You keep your options open. You don't try to not be, try not to uh, overreact. Uh, so, so, but there is, you've also had some kind of impact of, of this situation, Leo, I'm, I'm picking up, uh, but your attitude is okay. Uh, I can't do anything about it. So d let's just keep my routine. And that, makes everything easier to digest because you know you are saying well I still have my house here I still have my friends but there is something going on when it comes to love you are like oh no okay there I, I see here with the ace of cups okay uh, five of swords wheel of fortune it's just something that was getting closer and closer and closer and then boom someone was in in between here and um, there could be, so I'm getting Sagittarius to do with the child. Um, there is someone here, okay? It is possible that they have a child, this person. Something happened to the child or something happened to the baby mother of the child and it was just, they might have done it for attention, okay? But whatever, whatever the, the case might have been, the person at least Cause a major tower and change and, and now everything has to be restructured. It's stressful. Okay, a lot of people are impacted. This person don't know where they're going. Are they gonna stay in the tower? Are they gonna stay on the first floor? Is it a little bit left or is is they gonna fall anyway? It's like they're, they're, they're in a falling tower. The tower has fallen, but it could still fall, continue to fall. And they're, but they are so defeated that they can't even get out of the tower at the moment. So they're a bit sort of, and they're, they're, yeah, they feel defeated. Someone could start drinking a bit or they could suffer from depression, possibly because of the tower. Again, they just feel like uh, like a rabbit in the headlights. Uh, the Three of Cups and the Ace of Cups and the Ten of uh, Pentacles, it says here that, yeah, keep calm, <laughs> keep, keep calm, carry on here, okay? There is, there's half a group that is supporting this union, the half group that isn't. So it's like everything's a bit up in the air. I do see Queen of Pentacles. This could be someone ahead of a department, head of something that just came in like, bam, I'm gonna wreck this. And then there's jealousy here as well. There's someone, there's like authority figure, okay, boom, with the Ace of Swords. I do this because I can do it. Now let's, let's see how I can fry this shit up. So there could be someone suffering. That could be you, could be them here, that love is suffering because of this okay uh and it's unfair there's something to do with a, a an organization institution here but there's some someone here sent a message that was meant to hurt someone uh and that it it sort of ended it ended something here and now it's difficult for two people to get together yeah two people two people cannot get together because someone have like destroyed the tower uh, maybe it was a place you were getting to know someone, okay, it just seemed that it was great to work or see this person or maybe this person now had to move, like everything's changing. But it says here, okay, the Ten of Pentacles, it says still that there was that feeling, that union, that love here. There is this, okay, wish fulfillment, um, you know, you, you still think of this connecting with this person as, as a wish fulfillment. Something is in between. I, I see it's more world stuff. It's something like 
um, okay, two people get along, two people is not the fault of this, but the situation that has been sort of slammed into where two people are connecting, it feels like, oh, okay, where is this going to end? Okay, so something about authority, authority causing uh, confusion, making things uh, like chaos and chaotic and it's all it, I see it's uh, it, um, picking up like it, it's about money and it's it's just it's a situation is out of I feel it's your control their control really it's just very it's just happened and it's uh, an intervention I do see that this person eventually is realizing that okay um, okay I'm still alive I'll brush my 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 wounds off or heal my wounds all right what what can I expect now main female privileged lady there is some competition here like this could be a, a jealous female that sort of moved in was a thief they destroyed something they destroyed yeah this the, the coffin here someone have destroyed something they are angry and they are you know making that known thoughts from a mature man so that mature man could think of you even though they're going through a difficult time over here there could be bad health as well imprisonment so uh Sagittarius as well got this same uh, similar cards here okay someone here has done like two of you are witnessing I feel is part of an organization um I know there's also you know I heard that Due to is like the eclipse that was now it's a little while ago, but it says that you know leaders could step down and corrupt leaders could step down as well, uh, and that there is corruption and so on that is going on like people that is like just there's no love in the system kind of thing. No one thinks of that there could be two people that is in love, that two people that is sensitive and feeling it differently. Whereas everyone else is thinking about the money or like where should we party now or something like that. But for you, you're thinking about wh where are we going to meet? Where, where me Where's me and this person going to meet now? Okay, so no one thought of that. No one, everyone ignores that. But someone here, here will get caught. Leo. Yeah, someone in the midst of this is an immature, very, very selfish, yeah, selfish, immature decision to end something and there is chaos because of it for, for a long time, actually. It's causing a domino effect of, of chaos. It's like, okay, I went to work and suddenly my work was shut down, but then I went through all this stress and then, you know, this happened, this happened, this happened, actually, no, well, well, now I have an awakening, okay, so it's like all this crazy stuff, and it takes ages before two people get to connect again, but it says, open your heart, there is a separation, yes, but not forever, very soon, there is a soulmate connection coming together, so try to be as positive as possible, uh, passion here, calling in your soulmate, so it says here that if it's love, right, you will know if a, if a love can stand this kind of turbulence that's gone on here, then, you know, that is, that you will make it to the Ten of Pentacles, and, and that's the foundation, but two people have to sit each to their own through this tower. It's quite hectic. But because there is love that was witnessed in this tower when it's crumbled, this love, that feeling, it will never be forgotten, okay? And that can come back, okay? Even if it didn't start off as, okay, this is this was known. It could have even started off as more flirting, but then two people are separated and realizing, actually, I think it could have been more than that, okay? So someone here, this person I feel, is going to make that known. Despite the frustration, you are on your way to make all your dreams come true. It was a necessary ending so that you can pursue the life you're destined to lead and leave the past behind. And embrace what you have learned uh, and cherish your experiences because they are divinely faded. And do not give up on something because it did not work out straight away. Try not to resist the changes that are coming your way. Don't delay the inevitable. Travel as much as you can. This will add dimension to your life. So you will break free from all that no longer serves you. I'm going to pull another few messages. Leo, okay. Um, ah, there. So, 
Anything else for Leo? I feel like you're going to meet someone from your past here that's going to make things feel easier. You might be sort of, oh, I wonder if I will see this person again. I'm going to pull some cards here. What's going to happen to the person that Leo is dealing with? Okay, yeah. They, they're going to have a lot of burdens they have to detangle from. They feel confused right now. They're trying to find out what happened. What happened? When can I see the sun again? Okay, there was something, it happened so fast, this person is still in shock. It's like they feel, like, they feel depleted. They are going to find out there's a person, Queen of Pentacles, that did this. They did this to hold on tight to them, maybe. There's someone here that went to war behind the scenes that they're going to find out about. Yeah, trying to keep them uh, stuck, sorry. So here we have someone can, can be driven away to prison. Gosh, I had that as well in, in Sagittarius reading. Someone is driven away to prison, possibly from fraud or something else. Uh, yeah, something else. There is something that is not driven away to prison for fraud, basically. Yeah. You and this person, you have a past life connection. It's very sweet. I see that this person and you uh, will meet again for sure. This could be a twin flame um, union, okay? We have that for the first card as well, Ace of Cups, yeah. This will restart. It might feel like forever, but there will be a message from this person. They're gonna see the truth and there will be another tower when this person come in and tell you the truth. But for now, someone is out in the cold. Someone has been false. Someone has been doing someone dirty here. An immature person that have done something in spite. And yeah, see someone was just brutal. Just went in there and took it. But this connection here will come together, okay? Uh, there, is, uh, there is someone taking a new leap of faith coming together. The Ten of Pentacles. So yeah, do not give up. This connection is going to heal. It is meant to be. Someone is actually realizing a lot. There is an awakening going on as well. I see here someone here that hid. There's a person here between the two of you that hid something that was vicious, that, you know, they did it on purpose. But it says here, it doesn't matter what this person has done. They will get their reckoning. They will get driven away. Someone here has done something really nasty and it's going to be found out. The truth will come up and the truth will set the situation free. And there is a star shining between the two of you, okay? Eight of, uh, we have another eight of swords, okay? And ten of swords, something is happening. Someone's going to get caught. Someone's going to get what they deserve here. Someone's done something really, yeah, really nasty, really bad here. Attack. It's been an attack out of, an attack of an innocent person, like, just to destroy them. And it's worse than losing a job, almost. It's just someone that is, like, making them feel like they're going crazy, making them feel they don't have any support networks, starting to doubt their skills, starting to doubt... Like their motivation is down. Like it's like someone is like destroying someone overnight based on this news that is coming. So uh, let me know in the comment section. But this too shall pass and the outcome is going to be happy for sure. There will be a happy ending for, for this connection here. So uh, yeah, please uh, hang in there. Thank you for watching, Leo. Please like, subscribe and uh, yeah, share the video and leave a comment. I'll see you very soon. Take care.